What's up everybody, my name is Kyle and welcome to another Tourist Spot video. Today uh, it's just going to be a little quick video. Our weather has been pretty terrible so I haven't really been filming too much. Uh, I am dropping a new video here soon on Eastern Box Turtle Enclosures. Um, if you haven't seen the Three Toed and North American Box Turtle Enclosure yet, check that out. That uh, should be live right now. So, um, Our weather has been really windy and dry and cold on and off a lot of spring weather um this morning i did check on everybody fed them a little bit of missouri tortoise diet and uh hold on sorry about that that's another truck but yeah uh ended up feeding them this morning and uh seems like a few of them are getting up we're in the 80s this week so sorry another truck okay we're in the 80s uh this week so it should be pretty nice and they should start coming out here for spring our weather's been so up and down that they don't know what to do. So <laughs> anyway, let's go ahead and uh, check them out and uh, see what they're up to. All right, guys, uh, here's the enclosure for the mountain tortoises. As you can see, put a little log there. That's actually just an extra log I threw in here. Sorry for all the truck noises. Just, I live on a trucking route, I guess. So it's just non-stop trucks. Um, it's pretty annoying, but hopefully I'll move soon. You can see the pond is doing pretty good. I'm actually going to clean it one more time because it's springtime. And uh, I want to put real plants in here, some fish. I'm just waiting for this weather to really just kind of stop getting the 60 mile per hour winds, you know. It's pretty... When it gets the 60 mile per hour winds every other day, it's pretty bad, so. Um, the other half of the mountain tortoise enclosure. You can see it's not really growing back because the mountain tortoises don't let it come around this way here's some of the mountain tortoises you can see them eating that's uh those pellets are Missouri tortoise diet and uh I just like to feed that about once or twice a week right now I have no vegetables and my car is in the shop so I don't really have option and uh so I just fed them at some Missouri tortoise diet they seem to be enjoying it they love this stuff so you can see how big they're getting though there's four of them here. There's a fifth one somewhere, but we'll slide on down to this end. This is the three-toed box turtle enclosure. Try to keep it nice and woodsy. You can see it the eastern back here. Or this is the eastern box turtle enclosure. Pardon me. The three toads are on the other end. So you can see the eastern right over there hanging out. It's just warming up for them to start coming out too. So I'm actually gonna redo this one. And I'm gonna post the video. I'm redoing this enclosure and just kind of making it ready for summer and spring uh, pretty soon. So make sure you keep on that. But yeah, no one's really out on this end. So then we'll go over on this side. Part of the mess, guys. Super bright out here too. Here are the leopard tortoises. There's Charles and Tiny. And they're eating Missouri tortoise diet as well. And that little girl right there is Dolly. She's actually a Texas tortoise that I rescued from a friend. And they uh live with the or she lives with the leopards. They get along pretty well. And they just kinda hang out, eat, bask, and do their thing. And back here is the three toe box drill enclosure. You see uh, one three toed right there hanging out. Another one right over here. Sorry for the shadows. And they just came out as well, so they're pretty shy. Once they uh, kind of get a little more uh, active, they become a little more friendly and they start remembering me more. But I mean, they've been sleeping for a few months, so they just tend to. And last but not least is the wood turtle enclosure. I'm not sure if there's a wood out at all, but... Oh, there's a wood turtle right there. And you can see they don't have too many patterns, but... Uh, they're kind of 50-50 water turtle. All turtles are semi-aquatic. These guys are a lot more 50-50, though, where the three toads, Easterns, are a lot more land, you know. If you haven't already, also... Check out the stream video. And I just made a little stream for the three toads and the... North American wood turtles. 
Yeah, it's pretty quiet today. I just wanted to make a quick video for everybody. Kind of update everybody. I'm going to uh, um, hopefully make more little videos like this. I have a few projects here for Porter Spot. And hopefully uh, it comes out, turns out pretty well. I guess you can see the garden too. Again, our weather's been up and down, so I haven't, we haven't really started too much. Put a bunch of pinwheels down so it can scare away any birds that like to eat our plants. And then we put these little domes up that uh, kind of help uh, keep it warm during the day, keep moisture in. And when the windy and dry, it kind of helps out too, so. But, but anyway, there's a little update for you guys. Um, if you guys haven't already, hit like, subscribe. I'm going to be dropping a few more videos here. And once summer and spring hits, we're really going to start uh, dropping some videos. So thanks again, everyone, for all the support on uh, this channel. Seen a lot of uh, familiar faces, a lot of faces I've never seen. And the support has been awesome. So thank you, guys. Don't forget to uh, donate to your local uh, conservation. Let's all uh, help each other and uh, get this world where we want it. So thank you guys for uh, joining me. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys on the next video. Thank you guys. Bye.